To add a fillet bead weld bead to my part, I can choose fillet bead from the weld mitts ribbon if I've added it, or from the drop down menus, I can select insert weldments fillet bead. Over here, I'm going to deal with the arrow side. If I want a weld on the other side as well, I can turn on the other side option. For now, I'll shut that off. The first selection I have is what type of weld. I can go full length, intermittent, or staggered. For now, I just want to do a full length 3 16 fillet weld. I'm going to click in this box that says what is the first face set, and I'll come and choose this face of this plate. I'm done choosing my first face set, so I'm going to right click to tell it to end the selection and move to face set 2 cell. And I would like the fillet bead added along this edge and this edge on both sides of my gusset. So I'll select this face of the second plate, this face of the gusset, rotate around, select this face of the gusset. You can see the preview of the fillet bead. If I had right clicked before I moved my mouse, I could have accepted that. The preview looks good, so I'll accept that. I have a fillet bead now in my feature tree. I can see the fillet bead, and this has turned on the annotations here, the dimensions and the fillet weld symbol. If I don't wish to see those, I'll just right click on annotations and uncheck display annotations. So now I've added a 316th fillet bead in those locations.